Hey, those nerdy grads, it's Annie. I'm home, yay, woohoo! But five of the six of you already know that because I've been so lucky to already see you, except for Sammy, who's still at school, so uh, sorry, Sammy. But hey, you're with Lonnie this weekend, so yay. Um, it's really exciting to be home. Um, I have been completely lazy here so far. I have done pretty much nothing. Um, we finished Supernatural. Yeah, that's right. I finished Supernatural. Uh-huh. It was fantastic. It was absolutely fantastic. And yeah, I've just kind of been sleeping, doing some stuff. Um, my house got painted, so there's like nothing on my walls right now, and I really feel like my room is empty. Like, it's not even my room, because it doesn't even have much stuff on the walls. It's, it's all one color. What is this? How do people live like this? But you know, um... It's really great to be back. Yeah, so my theme from actually last week was how you think you've kind of grown over this first year at college or out of high school. Um, I think that I've changed a lot um, in very good ways, or at least I see them in myself. I think I've definitely become more confident and more like open-minded. I've met a lot of new and different types of people. Some are fantastic and some are so hard to deal with, but you know what? I got through it and it's really good and I'm really excited. And um, I watched Kristen's video and it was fantastic because she was talking about people who put themselves into boxes and I have felt over my years of you know since I became so self-aware of myself you know middle school probably something like that that I have always put myself into a box um not so much based on like sex or gender sexual orientation but more based on what I think the group that I'm with expects me to be like um, I've kind of tried to mold myself into, you know, their expectations or what I think their expectations are, which is always crazy because I don't even know their expectations. And it's, um, it's, I don't know, it's made me so, like, controversial about myself before because I'm like, oh, I don't even know if they really like me. And it's like, well, I'm not even being my true self. And I think over this new year, meeting so many new people and just kind of getting to know so many people and actually, like, spending time to get to know them, I felt that um, I've gotten to know myself a lot better and I've also been able to, you know, learn that people like me for who I am because I don't know what they expect from me, so I can't exactly put myself into that box. But I think that, like, coming back and, you know, getting to know a lot more of my friends here, I'll be able to kind of be more of myself, um, just kind of be out there and stuff like that. Um, hopefully, I'll get to see a ton of different people while I'm here. We have a lot of plans. Lonnie Floyd and I made a list of stuff, and I, like, really want to do stuff and how, like, baking nights and movie nights and go see people and people from my college and stuff like that. So yeah, um, if anybody wants to hang out, let me know or watch Supernatural because I want to watch it all over again. But um, I just think that this has been overall, this year of college has been such a good year. Um, I'm really excited for next year, but obviously I don't want to go back yet because I don't want to do more classes. Um, I passed all of my classes. Yay! I never have to take another calculus class ever. I just get to take linear algebra, whatever that means. Um, I have absolutely no idea, but I am excited to find out. Um, I'm excited to start taking official mechanical engineering classes, which is my official major for next year. I also officially declared a minor for technical theater, and so I will hopefully be doing cool stuff like that next year and hopefully grow a lot more as I begin to discover more about myself and where I want to be and what my dreams and my hopes are and, you know, where I'm kind of going with my life and where I want to end up. Yeah, and hopefully you're going to be there. Bye. You've just had the almost imponderable joy of watching those nerdy grads, which makes you, like, nerdy.